Hello, good afternoon, and welcome to a special edition of Swanage TV. It is Sunday, the 8th of November, it's approximately 2.45 and we are live. Um, I'm Ian, as you know, uh, my co-host today is Rosemary, and thank you very much for joining us. We are live. Hello, Rosemary, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, good, how good. are you? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. Um, we're doing a special broadcast today. We've been... Uh, asked by a few many viewers and a few other people you know why aren't we streaming live um for the remembrance sunday well we are so very shortly what we're going to do is we're going to hand you over to uh gary who is live at the scene hopefully with our wonderful mayor yeah say a few words before the program kicks off the events kick off at about 2 50. um we're quite we're quite honored to be able to bring it to you we know many people can't make it who wanted to go and want to uh attend these memorials but due to the covid they can't so uh we're quite happy to bring it yeah. to the purbeck area and uh and to the world if you want to see how it's all done and, uh, and people might be a bit confused because in swanage we've always done it a bit differently we've always had a three o'clock ceremony um rather than an 11 o'clock ceremony um this is because back in the day swanage never had a town band oh right okay so they never had a bugler that played so the, what they used to do years ago okay. was um yeah, had it at three o'clock. Fantastic. So they could share it. Excellent. Well, look, I'll tell you what we do. We're going to cut live now to uh, Gary on the scene. Let's go and say hello to Gary. Gary, how are you, sir? Good afternoon, Ian and Rosemary. How are you doing? Yeah, fine. Thank you, Gary. Um, Hi, fine. Gary. How's the weather? It's not raining. It's very good, actually. It's okay. pretty, it's quite calm, really. Um, so we're live here at the uh, Swanage Memorial uh, for this special broadcast um, to remember the fallen service men and women uh, that lost their lives in the line of duty. And uh, we're going to move quickly on because we've got a few things going on and um, we're on a, a time limit, really. Um, I'm with the, the Swanage Mayor, Mayor um, Councillor Mike Bomfield. Um, so, Mike, due to COVID, um, COVID regulations, sadly, many people couldn't be here. And... Uh, that, like what's all, what's all your, the views and it's been a difficult year for everything and i think this is now a time to remember and it's not only remember the falling those that sacrificed their lives for us during all conflicts but also remembering everything that's else else has gone on this year it is unfortunate that we can't have the proper um commemoration that we normally have here in swanage with all the parades and the church service but we can still remember them and I ask you all to please join us at three o'clock after the church bell is tolled 12 times for two minutes silence. This can be done anywhere. So please join us at three o'clock and um, remember all the falling and everything that's going on this day. Thank you. Thanks for that, Mike. OK, um, we're going to be shortly listening to the ceremony. Um, we are starting with Reverend Mann, I believe. Um, uh, over to the memorial so um ian if you want to um yeah that's that's no problem Gary. A if you you go and get into position and i'll just my move friend, over and uh yeah we'll, we'll get ready set up for it all and um we'll leave it running i think that's probably the best thing to do so uh just as um gary sets up there yeah we'll get ready we'll do the thing there's a few people in attendance not sure if richard drax is there but uh, we've got the mayor mm -hmm. and some wonderful wonderful people from the uh, royal british legion stevie churchill stevie the churchill. chairman of the legion they're all there paying their respects so uh with that in mind we're going to leave the uh cameras running i should imagine in about a minute's time we start with the reverend service mm -hmm. then we have a few other things it should end by about quarter past uh three so thanks for joining us. Yeah. We'll leave the cameras going and we'll come back at the end to uh, say goodbye. Thank you very much. Enjoy the show. Good afternoon, everybody. I hope you can hear me. And Owen, he's just woken up. Um, thank you for joining us here. Unfortunately, as you know, this year has been rather exceptional. 
we've had to organise the event slightly different. And officially, there is only seven of us, I think. I'm looking at John, is it seven or eight here? Um, so if I could just ask any of the public that's here to please stand behind the cameras, at least then when it goes out live, it looks as though we're adhering to all the regulations. Those of you that are out right there, please, please adhere to the two metre distancing. If you do need hand washing, that is available over in the public toilets in the car park. Otherwise, let's all please celebrate and make this something to remember. I also welcome our new trumpeter. So um, it's lovely to see you. And I hope you're looking forward to this as much as I am. And thank you to Helen, um, Swanish.news, who's streaming this for us. And also to Swanish TV, who are also doing a, a special live broadcast. So with that, I'll hand over to John and ask people to please take their places. Thank you. Good afternoon to everyone. Um, you are in your homes. A few of us are standing at Swanage War Memorial. Things are a little different this year, as we know. Normally, we would have a service in church and a parade to the War Memorial, where we will have our act of remembrance. This afternoon, under very different conditions, we're meeting to have a short act of worship and the silence at three o'clock. We hope that you'll be able to hear the 12 strokes of a bell of St. Mary's Church, which will mark the beginning of the silence. After that, we shall have the two minute silence, hear the bell again and lay the reeds. We have come to worship God, who is good and just and true. He created and sustains the world and loves us though we have failed him. We remember all who have given their lives in the struggle for justice and peace, all who suffer in war and conflict, and all who live in terror. We ask for God's guidance and blessing, that we may do his will, and that all peoples may acknowledge his kingship and reign. Whoever dwells under the shelter of the Most High and abides under the shadow of the Almighty, shall say to the Lord, my refuge and my stronghold, my God in whom I put my trust. Lord our God, our sure stronghold, hear the voice of our pleading and deliver us from every evil. Strengthen us as we strive for the poor and oppressed and establish your justice in all the earth. Amen. A reading from St. John's Gospel. This is my commandment, that you love one another as I have loved you. No one has greater love than this, to lay down one's life for one's friends. You are my friends if you do what I command you. 
I do not call you servants any longer, because the servant does not know what the master is doing. But I have made known to you everything that I have heard from my father. You did not choose me, but I chose you, and I appointed you to go and bear fruit, fruit that will last, so that the Father will give you whatever you ask him in my name. I'm giving you these commands so that you may love one another. Thanks be to God. Let us confess to God the sins and shortcomings of the world its pride, its selfishness, its greed, its evil divisions, and its hatreds. Let us confess our share in what is wrong and our failure to seek and establish that peace which God wills for all his children. O oh God of truth and justice, we hold before you those whose memory we cherish and those whose names we shall never know. Help us to lift our eyes above the torment of this broken world and grant us the grace to pray for those who wish us harm. As we honor the past, may we put our faith in your future, for you are the source of life and hope now and forever. Amen. We say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Let us remember before God and commend to his sure keeping all who have died for their country in conflict, those whom we knew and whose memory we treasure, and all who have lived and died in the service of humanity. They shall grow not old, as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them. We will remember them.
When you go home, tell them of us and say, for your tomorrow, we gave our today. Almighty and eternal God, from whose love in Christ we cannot be parted, either by death or life, hear our prayers and thanksgivings for all whom we remember this day. Fulfill in them the purpose of your love and bring us all with them to your eternal joy. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Let us pledge ourselves anew to the service of God and humanity, that we may help, encourage, and comfort others, and support those working for the relief of the needy, and for the peace and the welfare of the nations. May God grant to the living grace, to the departed rest, to the church, the queen, the commonwealth, and all people, peace and concord, and to us and all his servants, life everlasting. And to the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. Thank you, everybody. That um, concludes this very short service this year. Um, hopefully, we'll do a similar thing on Wednesday, as long as this one's work date. And I'm looking at the cameraman. We'll see what it comes out like and what the public tell us. But thank you, especially all those that have stayed at home and joined us in the comfort of their own home or even stood on their front door. So thank you very much, everybody. And let's look forward to a bigger, better one next year. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. Apparently, the live broadcast is now ceased, I've been told. Apart from the swimming TV is still going. Hi, Steve. <laughs> well, thanks back for joining us. Welcome back. Um, Gary, <clears throat> can you still hear us there? Please. I know you can. God, just reversing the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay, Gary. Gary, yes. that was really, um, really nice. That was, it was... Um, nice service. Yeah. Excellent. Do you know what? It was, it was really quite emotional, yeah. I thought. Mm. Hopefully there's a lot of viewers that uh, wanted to see it, so they got the... Um, obviously they couldn't come down here, so it was no, like that. Couldn't. There was there, there's a few here. there's a few here, but hardly any really. But um, no, I, I, Gary, yeah, all, I thought you did really well. Thanks for doing that for us today, Gary. I thought it was a, a really nice service, very respectful, quite a somber, sad moment. It really was, but um, you know, it was. that's what war does to you, you know. So it's a it's a it's a good thing that we we have the chance to remember these people. But listen, Gary, um, we're about to end. Yeah. Once again, my friend, thank you uh, for doing that for us. Really enjoyed that. And we will see you on the next show uh, on Friday.
Take care, Gary. Take care, Gary. Right. Thanks Thank very much. Thank you very much. Take care, everyone. Thank you. Wow. wow. There you go. Do you know what? The, the bugler, that's his first time of... of yeah, he, he, did, he, he did He did very really well, well there. Well done. Um, ladies and gentlemen, that, that's really it. Uh, it was sad. It, made it, me, is, it really it got really me sad. sad. Did you know my great-grandfather's remembered on the War Memorial in is the he? Is he? Harry Tell Stevens. Me. Is he? He died in Mesopotamia in uh, July um, 1917. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Uh, and for all the uh, the dead and the fallen yeah. since the First and World War, um, yeah. we fully respect what you did for us. Thank you very much. We will see you on a uh, new show back again on Friday. Thanks very much for joining us. Yeah, thank you for Goodbye. joining us.